I'm Johnny Mack. Uh, I'm a co-founder at VCC, Viking Combative Customs, and we specialize in custom Stoner 63s. It's me and my partner. Uh, we both are the co-founders and founders of uh, Viking Combatives. Originally, it was started by uh, Zika from Core. He came up with the idea of lightening and shortening the Stoner 63 and stumbled across the project, took it on myself and realized this is an awesome design and I'd like to improve on it. So the biggest thing that we do is we chop the barrel and we convert it to carbon fiber, which reduces the weight up to 72%. Um, another big thing that we do is chop the stock and uh, we have a 3D printed butt pad that's made of MJF, which is actually one of our newer products. Um, this shortens the stock to give it the more of a M4 length. And then the biggest thing um, a lot of people like is converting the box mag from the original Stoner 63 box mag to a more modernized 249 style box mag. So this adapter right here will allow you to use uh, 249 box mags. Well, the loading is a lot easier, uh, the feeding is a lot better, um, the box mags are more readily available and more common. Um, some Milsim events require you to carry more than one box mag, so the Stoner 63 box mags are a little harder to acquire and also harder to reload. Um, so having the uh, the option for a more 249 style or LBT uh, Mark 48, Mark 46 style box mag gives you a higher capacity and easier reload time. Having something that's a little bit lighter and quicker to use, I feel like it's very versatile and uh, it's just important in itself. It, it, personal preference, um, I'm not a big guy and uh, so it's a lot easier for me to run around one of these than if I were to run around with the original Stoner 63. One more recent platform that we're working on is uh, 203. For a, uh, for a Mark 18. So what we're doing is we're reducing the weight of the Mark 18 and the, the 203 launcher itself. We want to kind of just lighten the load and keep it more compact on an M-Lock rail. So we've created our own M-Lock rail and uh, 203 launcher uh, to sit a little bit closer to the barrel and also lighten the load completely. We have a few things in the, you know, in the works that are hopefully we'll be able to release this time or sometime this year. I want to say, probably third quarter, maybe late fourth quarter, we'll be able to release a little bit more information. But yeah, we do, uh, we do plan on work with, uh, with Nylon Gear. They can find us on Instagram at Viking Combatives Customs, or they can find us on our website at vikingcombatives.com.